Hey guys, Sarah from Irons Outdoor. Coming at you with another video, and uh, today we're doing the mini frog fishing challenge. So uh, yesterday I picked up this tiny little frog. It's actually a, a Lunker Hunt popping frog, and it's really small, so I thought I'd do a challenge with it. And basically today we're just gonna try to catch some fish on it. I just don't know how well the hookup ratio will be on this, but uh, we'll try to catch some fish. Oh, so I'm barely nudged at it. So I'm definitely over there. Oh, I'm trying to make that cast again. Oh yeah. Wow, that was a really far cast. It is awake going towards it. Hey, awake like went towards it. Oh, got him. Do I have him? I might not have him. Can't tell. Didn't get him. Getting a bunch of hits, but kind of like I said, I don't think the hookup ratio is going to be that good. So basically, as you guys just saw, I lost that fish on that frog. I mean, went back for it twice. Both times he didn't get hooked. And uh, that happened like five or ten more times that day until I finally caught a fish. Oh, I saw that thing skirt out of there. Never mind. Another he came back. Ooh. Ugh. Finally, finally landed a fish. It was on camera too. That's good. Man, this thing sucks at hooking a fish, but finally got it. Finally, finally got it. I've seen multiple bass up in this little cove here. I actually saw like a side of a bass. And uh really I got him kind of in his cartilage way back there. So uh, maybe they just need to swallow it more because uh, those tiny hooks are kind of hard to get on his lip. Oh, there we go. He was barely even hooked. Honestly, I'm probably really lucky to get this bass. I'm going to stick to this frog because we're doing the mini frog challenge. I only brought two other lures anyway that are both frogs that are kind of small, but I'm just going to try to stick to this one. Not a bad one. Pretty much average for this pond though. There he goes. So then after I caught that fish, that pond basically was dead. I didn't get a single bite or blow up after that. So I decided to switch ponds and I'm very glad that I switched ponds. Well guys, I didn't catch any more fish on that little uh, booyah frog. So that's why I came to this pond. Um, and I put back, I put this little uh, lung crunk frog back on. Hopefully we can catch one here. We only have like, honestly like 20 minutes I think. Yeah, we have like 20 minutes tops really. So uh, hopefully we can get on a fish. Got him. Oh, dang it. I had that guy for a second. Definitely a little bass. It wasn't too big. Oh, I had him again. He went back for it. This is a toad. This is so big. If I post this video, people are gonna want to come here. But uh, that is insane. Oh, I did actually bring my scale. <laughs> I'm gonna put it back. I'm just gonna weigh how much it is. Yeah. Okay. Okay. 2.16 kilograms. I'm pretty sure one kilogram is 2.2 pounds. This might be my PB. It's really weird to think about. I gotta let them have some water. 2.16. 4.76 pounds. I wasn't quite sure this is my new PB. 4.76, it was 4.25. So, Still, I've not caught a five pound bass, but either way, 
This is a huge bass. I need to let him get some water. He might get off. I want to get some pictures. But either way, I got it on film. I do kind of want a picture with this guy. I don't know how I would take a picture. There's a bench over there. I can somehow try to. He'll probably get off. But I need to let him have some water. Just gonna let this guy revive a little. So I'm gonna let him sit in there for a minute. If he gets off, he gets off. I do want a picture with him. But uh He still seems like he's good to go. Well guys, let's get a good release on this fish. I had it out of the water for kind of a while, but I did give it a break in between. So it should be good to go. This is a, such a hog, for this, especially for this tiny pond. I mean, almost five pound bass, basically a five pound bass. And I'm gonna make sure that he's ready to go before I release it. Still kind of holding on. Might need to grab its tail. Get a little bit more, it's kind of pushing. Ooh, it feels almost ready. Okay, there's more resistance, it's almost ready to go. I think she's ready to go. Swimming off. So, I left that other pond thinking this was a terrible bait. Now, the hookup ratio is not that good, but uh, I just caught my PB on it. I have a ton more respect for that tiny little bait now. That fish still was barely hooked. I still will say it's not the best best bait out there, but uh, it just caught basically a five pound bass, 4.76. Still, it's a pretty huge fish. 